All right, guys, so what do I work with when I bank it? Now, basically, I have a bucket. It's kind of heavy, but I use a bucket. Now, the reason why I put everything in a bucket, because affordable. You cover your bucket, you have your casters, your lines, whatever you need to have. You put it in your bucket, you cover it, rainfall, anything that happen, the bucket is safe. The bucket is very strong and nothing can penetrate it. So basically, I like to use a bucket. So I have my casters and whatnot in my bucket. So what do I have in my bucket? A bucket. So my kit, I would have different sizes of hooks, clip servos, servos, these are my beads, alright, these are beads I use on the hook to attract the fish, alright, I keep it pretty simple, this is for banking, so I have my kit, alright. I have my knife, I use the Billy Bay knife. This is a six inch filet knife. Pretty sharp, works good. So I have my knife. So this is my cord for my electric reel, so I just put it in a, a Ziploc bag. I have that in my pocket. I always have a caster with a floater line because you don't know who are looking on the top water. So if you're in a certain spot on the boat and you could fish with a floater line without affecting the other people's line, Set out a floating line, and you never know, codfish, kingfish, um, anything could be on the top. Alright, so you can have a floater line, you can put a piece of wire, I just have nylon on mine, but put a piece of wire to be safe. Alright, so I have my floater line. Um, this caster just have some leader line on it, so in case my line bursts, I could rig up a leader line. Alright, so I have that. I um, already have my pre-rig line. Well, this is a smaller setup. Alright, so I have my banking rig. So this is my banking rig here. I also have the big boy. These are the ones that I make for deep drop-in. Alright. Um, I also keep a pack of fish bites in my kit. So I want to test it out to see how it works. A lot of people say it works well when they're banking. So let's give it a try. I have my I have my banking line. Right, so I have a smaller size banking line here. Alright, this is fluorocarbon leader. So I have it on a fluorocarbon, a lighter line, just in case if I go in shallow waters. Alright, and then I have a bigger setup on this here, which is a hundred pound test. So I have a bigger banking line. I have my my two pound lead, my one pound lead, 20 pounds lead. And I have some squeezy to wash out my stuff when I finish. So when I come back home, I don't have nothing to do. Everything else will be organized and ready for the next trip immediately. All right, so I have that. I have my knife sharpener. I have my 60 pound banking line. And I have two knives. I have my 100 pound banking line, All right? I have my banking leader. I have my floater line. Well, I have my this, and I also have a portable charger. Then has a plug bag, right? I have my fishing kit, which is a small kit, which could fit in the bucket. Um, I have some wet wipes, as always well keep yeah, antibacterial wipes. A bigger knife. Fish bites, banking rig. And yeah, that's about it. Everything fit in the bucket. Comfortable. Oh, this is kind of heavy. Fit comfortable in my bucket. I close it. Rainfall, storm, thunder, lightning. Good to go in my bucket. Alright? So, sometimes people put it in a bag and the bag is not waterproof and they get wet. And yeah. I also have a container. I just carry my food and whatnot in a normal, normal container. I can buy it in the grocery that locks. So. This is what I use when I go banking. So I have my floater line, I have a big banking line, I have a smaller banking line set up, I have a banking rig and I also make my own um, rig using a T-nut, just 
a little more cheaper and effective and as a thinner line um, I use fluorocarbon because when you're making the tea nuts with the fluorocarbon it holds pretty good I find with the mono it is, it, 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 it is kind of kink up a little bit it's fluorocarbon more stiff so it's all good alright guys so just giving you some information in regards to what I work with when I go back in alright so hope you enjoyed the short video and uh, take care um, we have a sale to you as I posted before so um, I hope to see you and um, if you want to bank with us if you want to do some fishing with us, you can always send me a WhatsApp, 688-9095. Cool guys, later, bye. Morning guys, how are you going? This is Sai there from Trini Fishing Crew. I hope you're enjoying your Saturday. I hope you like my t-shirt. Kubera Snapper Whisperer. Yeah, I love my Kuberas. Yeah. Fish them more in shore. Um, anyways, today we have a sale. Alright, I know it's pretty last minute, but we're closing at 6 today. Alright, so... I just wanted to show you guys what we have. We have, first of all, we have the Pen Pursuit 4000 combo. It's a very nice light combo. All right. It's a medium action and it's a seven foot. So even if you want to throw out um, lures, you want to cast your lures, you want to throw out a, a running line, a banking line, and sure you can use this. Or even if you're banking in the shallows, you could use this very 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 nice it's very light it's a two piece seven foot so it's not that too not too long not too short all right so um it has the hd drag so it's a very good drag system it's a five ball bearing all right we could put some either mono or braid on it for you as well so these are one of the combos that we have and we have the thing with it which is the 10 foot 8000 so this is more for the shoreline so if you're fishing on the shoreline you're fishing on the beach all right you want to cast far you want to put some big line on it you could put some heavy mono or some heavy braid you could use this this is a 8000 combo with a 10 foot rod so we have the pursuit the 4000 and you have the 8000 you have them in the 7 foot and you have them in the 10 foot Right, we have the rod, which is the 5,000, so it's a medium size. This combo is, I believe, it's an 8 foot medium for sale as well. Right, this is a good combo. It's a little bit, um, it's a little bit cheaper than the Pursuit. All right, it doesn't have the, it doesn't have the HD drag, but um, it's a good, nice starter rod, you know. So you have the rod combo. We also have the alpha rods, which is the rod alone. We have the mini combo as well. All right, the rod alone here. We have this on special right now. We can get this for three fifty, and we have the rod and reel for five fifty. All right, so you pay two hundred more, you get the reel. We have the pen marina rods, which is a one piece rod. All right, there's a medium action and uh, it is a uh, six foot one piece so we have these and we also have the steady sticks all right this is shakespeare um this also is a medium action um it's also a six foot so for leader line i use fluorocarbon um it's invisible in water uh, material is a little bit different i find it stronger it's made in Portugal and um, it really makes a good knot. Like if you're trying to make a, a running line or, or a banking line with a T-knot, it, it holds a lot stiffer and better than the normal monofilament. So we have the fluoro and you have the mono. So we have the fluoro and mono from 10 pound to 80 pound this. We also have caster rigged with your banking setup. So you could either use the, we have the 200 pound test banking setup, which consists of the crane swivel tuna hooks and um, the barrel swivel, or we could make up one for you um, with, a, with a knot and rig it up for you. So when you're ready to go, it's just to drop your line. All right, we have the 60 pound test and we also have 100 pound test. The 100 pound test has around 450 feet and the 60 pound tests have 375 feet. All right. Um, with lures, we have the Mollet lure, 
We have a DOA call, we have a DOA terrorize, we also have filling knives from the Billy Bay. Um, this one is a 6 inch and then we have the 3 inch. You could cut your bait, fillet your bait and make sure you have a proper knife when you're filling bait, especially Bonito and your Joshua. If you don't have a proper knife, you realize your, your, your bait is they don't cut properly. Yeah, it is waste half a bit, so that's important. So if you want, come and check us out at the store today. Um, we have Bonito available as well for sale. And um, if you're looking to do a little fishing and you want to fish with us, you could always send me a WhatsApp. My contact number is 6889095. You can check us out on Waze, Trendy Fishing Crew. Send me a WhatsApp, I'll send you my location. We are located in Mohammedville, 12 Mohammedville, Elsico Road, San Juan. All right, and... Um, yeah, we'll keep in touch, guys. I hope to see you soon. So we close today at 6. We have we have a couple other items on sale, so you can come and check us out. And you'll get the prices, description, bring a line. If you want assistance and rigging up some lines, if you need anything, let me know. If you're doing some shoreline fishing, I could advise you on a couple spots as well. And um, we'll keep in touch, okay? Trini Fishing Crew, out.